Okay, check this out, guys. Once I transition to side mount, a lot of times uh, my opponent's gonna try to go for a bow and arrow. So watch what I do with my head and my arm to be able to defend him getting his grip. So he's gonna be stuffing here, and he's gonna be trying to dig with the other hand, okay? When he dig, yeah, do you just go by my, sh like, go here, by my neck. Do you feel how the energy goes to my neck? But if you come towards my head, you feel that? So that's really important. Just because your head is a little bit round, um, you can't close up all the space around your head. So you kind of have to transition where you focus your energy, where you kind of focus your pressure to be able to stop their hand from coming in. So this is a little drill I do. It's a sensitivity drill, and it's basically training to defend the bow and arrow. Yeah. So what happens is my head is kind of round, right? Like, kind of. But, and then this is not really flat either, okay? So what happens is there's always a space. So what happens for me is when I feel, where I feel his hand, that's where I'm gonna have to go closer. So, so that's really important. If you notice, I'll use my head to block his hand from coming in and I'm putting pressure wherever I feel the hand come. If, do you guys see how I'm driving my head? So if he comes here, I drive my head. So if he puts pressure at the top of my head, it's the top of my head where most of the pressure goes. If he tries to come in by my neck, then I put more pressure with my shoulder and my neck together. Come in by my neck, I drive in. So I'm putting pressure where I feel his hand trying to come in. So just close your eyes. The other person can be pushing on your collar. I just want you guys to close your eyes and just feel that you're driving and closing up space where you feel. And do it slow at first and then you can pick up a little bit of pace if you start to feel comfortable. That's the drill.